hey you guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to be doing a love reading for the zodiac sign of aquarius so if you have aquarius in your birth chart this video may resonate with you so don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe so let's get into the reading spirit guys of love and light ancestors and masters my angel of and light please protect this deck from any negative energies please i'm to receive current concise messages from my lovely aquarius spirit guides of love and light ancestors and masters remove any negative energies from this deck you guys i had dyed this wig it was blonde but i dyed it gray. it was like gray and blue but the great hair dyed name was tsunami and the blue this is a safari blue okay you know that adore hair dye i ordered it from amazon and this wig off amazon too but y'all it was it looked way better than this it was curly and stuff i got on this thing because my edges need to stay laid okay period but if you guys have instagram follow my instagram okay the uh, my instagram handle is in this in the description box down below so y'all can see how it looked okay and if you got an instagram and you don't follow me what is you doing like you're supposed to be connecting okay i love connecting with y'all and seeing y'all if y'all got social media okay but if you don't it's cool I can still connect with you through the comments, okay? Y'all still can email me, too. Like, if you, you know, just because I don't do readings anymore, don't mean that y'all um, can't email me, you know? Because I'm still willing to help out if you need, like, advice or, you know, need, like, a little two-minute, five-minute reading. I got y'all, period, okay? So, let's see what's going on for... My collective. We have the Six of Wands. Okay. We connected to a Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, the Magician, Gemini, and the Eight of Pentacles, Virgo. So I'm seeing that you guys could have started some type of business here or whatever you do for work, you're very good at it. Okay. You could be receiving a higher position at work or a raise. Or I'm seeing here it's like you guys could be going to a different job because i'm seeing here it's like you was working somewhere and it's like it was people like your employees that was starting to get jealous of you okay or these people would just just envy you for no fucking reason because you that motherfucking bitch period okay and i guess these people could have just ganged up and tried to get you fired or some shit like that it's some weird ass shit that was going on at your last job but i feel like it wasn't meant for you to stay there Okay, I feel like you had bigger and better opportunities waiting on you. And I feel like you are experiencing that now. Okay, and I feel like these people that thought that they was going to, like, fuck with your money or something like that by getting you fired. These motherfuckers ain't doing good as you. Okay? I feel like you probably not even working for nobody. I feel like you are meant to work for yourself. Okay? And it's okay if you work for somebody okay just because i said it don't take offense to it because i know motherfuckers be sensitive as fuck okay that's probably why my views be going up and down because of how i say things but if you don't like how i say things i'm glad stop watching me okay because there's a lot of other amazing readers that you can watch but this is how i do my readings okay so we have the nine of cups what else yeah, I feel like you're fulfilled, okay, you're content, you're happy as fuck, wealthy, you could be living a luxurious lifestyle here, and I feel like you don't play about whatever you do when it comes to work. For some of y'all, y'all could be hiring people for your, your job, okay? I'm seeing here, you are doing so good that you could be celebrating, it could be people that's, you know, um, buying, like, whatever, I'm, I just heard buying, so it's some type of product that you sell, and it's very good. And a lot of people buy it. I don't know if you make food or you make hair oils or crystals. Like crystal necklaces or bracelets or something like that. Because I really get that you're a spiritual too. For some of y'all could be like doing like money spells. But I feel like you're very talented. Like your hands is... It, it makes whatever you make and it, it does what it needs to do okay <laughs> i feel like you are a great manifester literally whatever you touch turns into some other fucking gold 
And I feel like the fool. You're not keeping yourself stuck in a box. Because I feel like for some of y'all, y'all could be multi-talented. Like, you know how to do a little bit of everything. Like, you're just talented as fuck. And I feel like that's why people could be hating on you here. Because you could be in your life purpose. Or I'm saying you could have, like, a lot of gifts. You know, like, you're very good at a lot of stuff. And there's people here that's not as good as you. And they see that. And they be like, wow, like, I wish, you know, I was good at that. Or I wish I could do that. You feel me? Like, bitch, you can. It's called practice. The fuck? I feel like anything somebody put their mind to, they can accomplish it. But people, they're stupid. They don't think like that. They rather hate and be jealous. You feel me? And copy you. It's okay to be inspired by somebody, but copying them and trying to, you know, be like them is ridiculous. So we have the full card and the judgment. Yeah, I'm saying you guys could be going on vacation. Okay, I'm seeing here as well that you could be like moving. It's like you could get up and move when you're ready. Okay, like you're set. You're set for life. That's what I'm hearing in my head. But I'm getting to hear that you could be meeting somebody here. And I feel like you're going to take a leap of faith with this person. But I feel like this is the person that you are meant to take a leap of faith with. Like this is your person. Yeah, I feel like with the judgment here, you have went through an awakening here. Okay. And I feel like you kill, you could have cleared out any karmic debt that you had. Hold on, you guys. I, I have cookies on. Hold on. I forgot. I'm back. So, I feel like with the judgment as well, that somebody here is going through their karma. I feel like you stand with this person that wasn't good for you in your past. Okay, they were trying to block you from reaching your highest potential. Not only that, they were trying to block you from true love. And I feel like this person, they're going to karma for that they're being judged for their actions i feel like somebody here tried to ruin your reputation here or something like that or make you look bad or make you like a hoe or something like that or expose like if you have like naked pictures or videos or something like that because i feel like you already see a lot of, a lot of attention because you are attractive you know you're beautiful you're handsome or whatever you do for work you feel me and that's how you could have got fired from your job. I'm getting here because somebody here could have caught up to your job or they did something stupid here. And I feel like the person that was supposed to take your side, they end up taking this person's side that you was dealing with. And it was okay because, like I said, it wasn't meant for you to work there. But now look at you. You're getting more money than that job was paying you. We have the will of fortune in reverse. Yeah, and this person's karma is that they don't have shit. They can't manifest anything. <laughs> now, all these people that were trying to go against you, they look dumb. They look stupid. And I and I bet you, you was the best motherfucking employee at that motherfucking job. We have to send them cups. So, yeah, this person, they're sucking an illusion. Okay? They keep running into karma to this person they're never going to find true love. That's their fucking karma. And look at you. With your wish for feminine, with the nine of cups here. And if you're not with your wish for feminine right now, I feel like you're content with yourself. You're enjoying your own company. You feel me? Ain't nothing wrong with that. You don't have to be in a relationship 24 fucking 7. I feel like this person, they hop in and out of relationships. They get out of a relationship, go to the next relationship. You feel me? Like, don't even take the time to heal and learn themselves. You feel me? And I feel like as soon as you took a leap of faith and you got away from this person, you didn't. You weren't worried about finding love and getting in that relationship. The fuck? You was worried about doing your healing work with the judgment here. Seeing the truth about shit. Being honest with yourself. I feel like you judge yourself. You look within. You did some introspection here. You know, something this person don't know shit about. We have the Queen of Cups here. Yeah, and I feel like... You didn't allow this situation to turn you into a hateful person than the queen of cups. I feel like you still have a lot of love in your heart. You're ready to give love. Okay. Now the pentacles, yeah, you're independent here. Okay. I feel like you handled the situation very gracefully. Yeah. See, ten of cups. Look at you. You're about to have a, a whole family. Marriage, home, cars, all that. And I feel like you broke a generational curse here. Yeah, see? The imprints. And people be thinking that motherfuckers just 
come out being the empress. No, you have to grow and evolve. Okay, because I'm pretty sure everybody was in karmic energy before. You know, you're just not going to be the empress. It takes a lot of work to be the empress. And I feel like you put in that work. And that's why you're getting rewarded. You didn't half-ass do something. Or you didn't try to avoid your karma or anything like that. You know, you dealt with the shit. And now look at you. And you have your emperor here, period. The emperor and the empress. I feel like you both could have went through a, a ascension process. You know, y'all could have had like similar situations that happened to y'all that was going on with y'all exes and shit. So this person must definitely understand you. Yeah, seven of pentacles here. And I feel like you, like I said, you have your hands in a lot of things. Okay? Very abundant. Very wealthy. Very responsible. You handle your priorities. King of Cups. See? King of Cups, Queen of Cups. Seven of Wands. This person, they don't play about you. And I feel like you don't play about them. <laughs> okay? They're very protective of you. And not in like a smothering way. You feel me? You have the hangman here. And they are not this person from your past. They want to fucking fight. Yeah, and I feel like this person, the Five of Cups in reverse, they, they helped you forget about this person from your past that tried to keep you stuck so bad. That tried to keep you confused. With the two of swords here. That wanted you to be scatterbrained. Yeah, they help you. The four of swords here. I feel like this person, they make you feel safe. Like you could let, let your guards out with them. Because I feel like you had your guards up for a minute. Because you was like, I hope this person, you know, ain't no shape shifter trying to come in. You know, acting like they are just, you know amazing and they have all these skeletons in their closet you know and i feel like this person very trust i mean honest and upfront with you now i feel like somebody here they think they're trying to think about you i don't know what this person logic is right now but i really get like this person they're thinking about you 24 7 this person from me from your past like they wake up thinking about you they shit thinking about you eat thinking about you they probably check your social medias if you have social media. But if you don't, it drives them crazy that they don't know what you're up to or they can look and see what you're doing or some shit like that. But I thought this person, they're trying to look for another you. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. They're trying to find somebody here that they, they feel is like secure like they have a job, a car, a home, shit like that that they can use. <laughs> this person is hilarious. So they, they lay down with these type of people. Because this person, they don't have shit. They can't manifest anything. So they, they have to, you know, go about life this way. where well, they don't have to, but this is how they choose to. Yeah, and I feel like... You was you weren't even focused on love, like I said earlier. I feel like you was, you know, busy, you know, resting, recovering from the situation with the four swords. And this person that came in like a knight of shining arm with the knight of cups here. Okay. And I feel like this person, they 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 love pampering you. They love giving to you. This person they are a giver. They are a pleaser too. Okay, we like to hear that. And yeah, and I'm with Ace of Swords, this person's very trustworthy. And I feel like you, you know, you can tell this person anything, you know. As, as it should be. And I feel like, you know, this person, they treat you right. This is your justice. This is your, your good karma. And what they want here, it's like this ex here is waiting to see if something's going to fall apart in your new connection. And it's not. I'm here to tell you, it's not, bitch. So move the fuck along. Yeah, pay the swords. They're watching you. Two of Pentacles. This person, they're stuck with their, their finance. They don't have shit going on here. And whatever bitches that they are fucking on and talking shit about, I mean, trying to get sympathy from, because they're talking about you to these bitches, making it seem like you did them so wrong and shit like that, or you are the reason why they like the way it is right now. They're waiting on these people to give to them. <laughs> and this person don't get shit. Matter of fact, these people that they be fucking on be waiting for this person to give them something. Like, can you give me some money? Like, mm. so whatever this person is doing, it, it failed. Yeah, they don't have shit. <laughs> and they just watching you because they see like, wow, like, I really fumbled somebody here. 
I really found them dumb. Now this person can help but to look stupid. So, I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. If you did, I hope you liked this video. Comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.